the lands of Zara. The humans of Koopa Keep struggle to stay alive as they are attacked by the wicked drow elves of Larnia. Darkness falls as the humans beg their king to save them, a noble king known only as the Grand Wizard. For a thousand years the battle has been waged, with only the bravery of the Grand Wizard to protect his human followers. But even though the Wizard King is so undeniably cool, the drow elf armies continue their attacks. They seek the human's most treasured relic, the Stick of Truth. But the tides of war soon change, as news of a new kid spreads throughout the land. In order to save the humans, the Grand Wizard must get to the new kid, before the drow elves can manipulate his man and use him to take the sacred relic from human hands. For whomever controls the stick, controls the universe. Well, I think that's everything. We did it, hun. We're really moved in. It's a new beginning for us. Things are finally going to be good. Do you really think it will be better for him? They won't look for him here. We just need to make sure he doesn't attract any attention. Come on, let's see how he's doing. Sweetie, hun, you all dressed? Hey, champ. How do you like your new room? I know it's a big change for all of us, but, son, do you remember why we moved to this quiet little mountain town? He doesn't remember. He doesn't remember at all. That's good. That's good he doesn't remember. Uh, sweetie, we want you to have lots of fun here. Why don't you go out and make some friends? Right. Get outside and play, son. Like, like normal kids. We've got some money for you on the kitchen counter, sweetie. Just be back before it gets dark. Yeah, we love you too.
Go on outside, sweetie. It wasn't a request, it was a command. Now get out there and make some friends. You shall die by my warhammer, Drow Elf! Uh-uh! But banish thee to the forest realm! No way, I banish you first! Haha! <laughs> you can't hold out much longer! Help! Somebody! I can't hold out much longer! Help! Hey, no fair! That's cheating! I'm gonna tell my mom! Thanks, kid! I didn't realize he had a health potion! <laughs> my name is Butters the Merciful! I'm a paladin! I live right next door to you! We should be friends! Now that we're friends, you should speak with the Wizard King. He's been talking about your arrival. The wizard lives this way, in the greenhouse, over there. Hey, where are you from? Where'd you live before moving here? You like Colorado? Oh, hail the Grand Wizard! So, you are the new kid. Your coming was foretold by Coldwell Banker. I am the Wizard King. But the time for talk is not nigh. Let me show you my kingdom. Oh, who's your new friend, Eric? Shut up, Mom. Not now. Welcome to the kingdom of Koopa Keep. Our weapon shop here is tended by Clyde, a level 14 warrior. Here you can see our massive stables, overseen by the level 9 ranger, Scott Malkinson, who has the power of diabetes. And here, of course, is the breathtaking and lovely Princess Kinney, the fairest maiden in all the kingdom. Don't ask why Kenny wanted to be a chick, it's just how he seems to be rolling right now. You may have heard of my deeds at the Battle of Stark's Pod. That's the line the Grand Wizard gave me. Sorry, but the Grand Wizard told me to stick to the script. That's the line the Grand Wizard gave me. Be careful, the Rock of Insanity holds mysterious powers. Okay, you're insane now. If you want to be healed, you must gaze at the rock again. Okay, you're healed. Okay, you're insane now. Okay, you're healed. Ah, yes, the pool of vision. Beautiful, isn't it? Do not disturb the sacred waters. You're messing with powers you don't understand. My loyalty is as incurable as my diabetes. The power of diabetes is both a gift and a curse, but mostly a curse. The Grand Wizard would hold snacks if we talk off script. Stick to your lines. No talking, Scott. The power of diabetes is both a gift and a curse, but mostly a curse. The Wizard Stump. Perhaps one day I will show you what it does. 
Some say he who discovers the secret of the wizard stump is the master of his own destiny. I think the wizard stump. Perhaps one day I will show you what it does. Ah, you have located the training area where our massive army learns to fight. You have been sought out, new kid, because humans everywhere are in great danger. I need something from you, and in return, I am prepared to allow you into my kingdom. I know you are very excited. It's time for your first quest, but first, please tell us thy name. You entered Douchebag, is that correct? Are you sure you want to keep the name Douchebag? Very well, Douchebag. You will now choose a class. Fighter, Mage, Thief, or Jew. A Mage is like a wizard. A fighter has courage, honor, and the ability to kick fucking ass. A Mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. You look sneaky enough to be a thief. Jew, huh? So I guess we'll never really be friends. A white thief? Never heard of one, but interesting. A mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. A white fighter? Haven't seen a good one of those in a while. A mage is like a wizard. You look sneaky enough. Jew, huh? So I guess we'll never really be friends. Welcome to the KKK douchebag to Jew, who probably can also handle our finances. Hooray! Now please, go and visit the weapon shop. Procure yourself a weapon and we shall teach you to fight. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? Perhaps you would like to hear tips and rumors for two dollars? Don't waste your money on tips and rumors. Ah, Don't let it bother you person. that there's a game to be played. You have procured a weapon. Yes. It's now time to teach you how to fight. I want you to take your new weapon and, with the bravery of a noble knight, beat up Clyde. What? Kick Clyde's ass, new kid. What I do? I'm the king, Clyde, and the king wishes to be amused. Go on, new kid. Kick his ass. I'm gonna kick your ass. Clyde, you have to wait your turn. That's lame. No, Clyde, it's like olden times. You have to wait your turn. Like in the Middle Ages, Clyde. I know it's lame, Clyde, but that's how we're fucking doing it. All right, douchebag, bash Clyde's face in. Don't be shy. Come on, fight! That all you got? Oh my god, it's butters all over again. Okay, look. Try putting your back into it at the last possible moment. Oh! Ah! <sighs> Try again. Focus right before you strike. Ugh. Oh, hell yeah! Clyde's your bitch! Alright, Clyde's wearing armor. In order to hurt him, I want you to hit Clyde as hard as you can. Heck! Oh shit, dude, I think I see blood! Fucking nice, bruh. It's exactly what you do to guys with armor like that. Okay, listen up. The key to surviving in battle is not to get hit in the bows. Clyde, it's your turn to attack. Douchebag, protect your bows. Prepare yourself. This does double damage. No, no, I said protect. Protect your bows. Ouch! No, that's not blocking. That's sucking. Try again. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about! Dude, you're already way better than Clyde! Alright, it's time to use your heroic powers. Using your ability takes power points, or PP for short. <laughs> PP. <laughs> if you have a fucking better name for them than fucking say it, Clyde! 
fucking asshole. I'm the king and I say it's PP. Douchebag, use your Jew ability to make Clack pay for insulting the king. Dude, that was pretty lame. Try it again, dude. It didn't count. Do you have some kind of problem with authority? Do what I told you. Use your authority. I dodged that. Douchebag, that's not your heroic ability. Get serious. Dick. Way to wipe that smile off his stupid face, douchebag. Now do it one more time. Finish him. What? I was going easy. Take this. Okay, okay, you prove yourself worthy, douchebag. Now come inside the war tent and I shall let you see the relic. 